here. I'm live. We're ready to shoot. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be presenting to you guys Rod Cologne by Toyo Cologne and I will be using about 5 packs of these and um, this hair is pre curled and ready to install. Don't forget to get your latch hook, a pair of scissors and of course your box of hair, okay? So let's get right into this, it's going to be very very quick. So my hair is already braided up and I'm just going to be doing a regular crochet install. Nothing new, nothing different. Now my cornrows are about a couple days old so we're looking at like, I've gotten like two different uh, crochet hairstyles from this cornrow so that's why it's looking a little dusty so excuse that and yeah I'm just separating the curls before I install them because I like my curls to look to have that frizzy look because I feel like that's more realistic um, instead of having that really straight perfect curly look because then you look like you have noodles in your hair and I already talked about this in my last video so that's why I separate them to give them that like natural look because on a natural on a natural hair person their curls are not like perfect you know it always has like that textured look so that's why I always separate it and I have a total of I think one two three four five six about 12 braids okay uh, I think <laughs> all going back um, I'm not gonna be doing two connecting braids on my parts because I'm gonna be wearing it falling towards my face and there really wasn't any need for that so I'm gonna show you guys all I did is just like um, when I install the locks, I always over direct them towards my face so that way whenever I'm done, the hair is going to kind of fall towards my face and kind of have that afro-ish look to it, okay? Now, this color might scare a lot of people, okay? I get it. It's gray and it's curly. Um, that's like a lot for some people, but good news, they have loads and loads loads. <laughs> <laughs> they have lots of colorful, you know, options for you if you want the little subtle 1B or if you want something on the louder side like the grays. So they come in different um, lengths as well, I believe. Um, and it also tells you never to comb and brush this hair. But you guys, I did end up like, I didn't brush it. I used a white tooth comb, which I'll show you guys in a minute. Um, I just used it to like stretch it out. You know, but I'll show you guys. You see what I mean in a little bit. But yeah, so when I get to the middle, I am just installing the crochet in the direction I want it to fall. So I am just positioning the latch hook, uh, the crochet hair towards my face instead of dropping it to the side. I drop it to the front of my face. I wanted that like a really dramatic and colorful look. Uh, I know I look like your grandmother, but please put some respect on my name <laughs> because I could stay your granddaddy. Okay. Okay, now we're looking like somebody. So take a wide tooth comb, you guys. Don't take like a really like tight comb. Just take a wide tooth comb. And what we're doing is just like stretching the hair. I'm not really like combing out the curls too much because I've already kind of separated them. I just kind of wanted to have a little bit more volume. So I'm just going over it like maybe like a couple times. Not too much because you don't want it to be all frizzy. Just enough to where you have some curly pieces and then you have some textured pieces. You know, just like all mixed in because it looks more like, oh, it's kind of looking like natural curls. And, you know, like just mix it all up. You know, don't let it, to, don't let your curls look too perfect because then it looks fake, especially with the color. So you want to make sure that you take that white tooth comb and brush it out. And yeah, so what I ended up doing is just using my hands to kind of finger comb through it after I got the, the mixture of fuzzy and curls that I wanted. I just used my hand to kind of like shape the hair, you know, give myself a little bit of hair on the front and shape the sides to kind of fit my face. Um, but yeah, try not to, you know, do that too much either because you don't want it to be like all fuzzed up. 
Do you get? But anyway, so when you're going to bed, just take satin wraps and you're good. And the next morning, just finger comb once again and you're good to go. <laughs> okay, so just um, take a pair of scissors and cut off any stray hairs and you'll be good to go. And just like that, girls, we are ready to go to the nursing home, okay? <laughs> I'm just kidding. But anyway, so I'll catch you guys in my next video. Have a merry day and God bless. Bye, guys.